G'day everyone, Viv here, hope you're all keeping well. Good morning. Oh boy, it's been way too long between updates. Crazy stuff going on, moving house and all that sort of business, so that's been distracting us a little bit. Time for a very quick update. I've got a little bit of time between right now and when I have to take the daughter to the doctor for her injections. She's gonna scream, she was screaming last time, she's four months old, it's gonna be more screaming. Uh, it's gonna be uh, a little tough, but uh, it will be all right. So, quick update. Two things I just want to quickly mention. I'll grab the camera and we'll go for a bit of a wander. So, uh, one right behind me, the uh, casting equipment. Finally, the plumber is coming to rig up the gas line for the furnace, which means I can then use the spin caster to spin up some of the molds that uh, I've made. Down the back here, I built this big giant hot wire cutter Unfortunately, my power is not hot enough to heat up this wire to cut the uh, extruded polystyrene. It'll cut expanded polystyrene beautifully, but the extruded stuff, it's just uh, needs to be a tad hotter, so I need to get a different power supply for that. Um, and then down the back here, <clears throat> I've been working on shields. Let's just pop this down there in the press. So that shield is going to end up as a Roman shield for uh, a customer. That's my custom shield, which I'm building two of for, again, for other people. And I built this little set of terrain for somebody who contacted me on Facebook. And I was after some pieces and I had some uh, of these uh, polystyrene, uh, expanded polystyrene hills laying around. And uh, so I thought, look, I'll finish those off and just do a quick, simple, cheap job for that client. This is a bit dusty, but uh, that'll get cleaned up properly. So, what's there? Five pieces of five five rock sort of structures. That pond and two independent trees. Um, yeah. So that's uh, been about it. Had fun working on that. So I'm looking forward to doing some more scenery once I get some of this uh, place um, cleaned up a little bit. <laughs> oh yeah, I'm also working on this. I had this hanging around from the bunker for ages. It's a, uh, I don't know, well, I think it's a 3x4. So it's going to, let's go on the side here. Oh, terrible. This is terrible, Viv. What are you doing? Um, so I've been casting up her starts pieces to line the inside. This will all be uh, a canal system with water in it and then texture this up with a cobbled sort of surface for uh, games of uh, uh, what's called Mordheim what's happening in here I've slowly been clearing out some of my miniatures which has been fantastic I actually have some desk space this was all piled up before with what was here three boards of orcs tyranids uh, what else was here I don't know I can't quite remember now I want to finish working on these ogres Almost done, I've just got uh, a couple of units left. But uh, now we're just starting to ramble. So uh, no point rambling on. Just wanted to put up a quick update before we head off to the doctors. Lots more to come now that I'm getting this place sorted out a little bit. Um, There's going to be uh, exciting times for me ahead. So thanks for watching. Thanks for sticking with me. I'll see you next time. Bye.